hey guys welcome back to this channel in this case i will be teaching you how to play on your pc the new mario and luigi brother chips i will be teaching you how to configure the region simulator to be able to come to make and have the proper settings to be able to play this game so please keep in mind that all the files that we're using in this video you will be find on the pink commentary section so make sure to take a look to be able to have the correct information for this emulator so i will be continuing with the with the tutorial in this case you will be have the rings and file you only have to extract to make sure to press extract to because it will be extracting all the files on your desktop or folder where you have this download for the reason i refer that extract to to make a folder and have the emulator over here after that the emulator will be extracted successfully and you only have to open the range that exit okay it will be open the same media full and after that it will be open the regions as you can see in this case what we need to do now it will be just make a soft configuration in that case it will be just install the keys and the firmware for the reason you also need to also extract the additional files because at this moment the region is currently installed on your pc the next step will be just simple you will be just extract additional files it will be given us two folders firmware and keys will be open the keys folder and we have over here we only have to copy these two files and then on the regions we only have to go file open regions folder and then on system will be just placing these two files we have the key successfully installed on our emulator and then the next step will be install the additional firmware that will be just going to tool install firmware install a firmware for a directory and then you only have to select where is your firmware folder downloading in that case it will be on my desktop i select and then we have to press yes it will be installed in the firmware and that's all we have the keys and the firmware totally installed on the emulator the next step will be just go to options settings and here what we need to do is make the in essential configuration in that case i'm going to directory you can add where you have your games in my case i have my games on the downloads then on input you have to make sure to select the best and option to play the games in that case i'll be using an xbox series X controller you can use also a playstation 5 or even a nintendo switch controller on your computer make sure to have the correct um, mapping process for this one to make sure that you have the correct um, emulation then on system make sure to have the closest region for you in that case i will be using usa you can select the one that you are close in my case usa the most close on system language you can also select the preferred one in my case it will be latin american in spanish and then make sure to activate fs integrative checks then go to cpu make sure to turn off this pptc and also memory management leave on host unchecked pass on save on graphics this is really important because it will be depending on your computer if your computer have an old nvidia or amd gpu on linux you make sure to have using open gl if you have a really actual a new graphics card you can use Vulkan. also in that case you can try both in order to see which will be running better for you but i recommend to use vulcan if you really have a really good graphic card that is on that will be new on say that way and the rest you can turn off these three check boxes and resolution scale will be the same if you have a really good graphics card you can use higher resolution if you have a not um, able to capable computer you can use native resolution in that case i will be using native because this game is demanding the reason i recommend if you do not have a really good graphics card to use native and then in aliasing you can use fss or none because in scanning filter will be as fsr on 80 percent and then you can list 
here on a stroke filter and automatic and a spec ready that will be depending on your monitor type but I, I prefer to use a try to defeat window and then you only have to press apply and okay and we have the emulator to really configure data I will be running the game now to be able to show you that the game is running without any issues It will be take some time, so it will be the first time that you launch the game, but the game is totally stable and able to run without any issues. It will be take some time to run the game, but don't worry, as you can see, the game is running perfectly without any issues. In that case, I'll be just making a new, a new game. And as you can see, the game is running without any issues. You can configure the emulation of the process that you really do want to really have the really good performance. At the first time, keep in mind that it will be completely up the shard cache. The reason is something that gets price racing for a little couple of seconds and after that, the game will be running perfectly on your computer. Luigi! As you can see, the game is totally stable and you're able to ruin it without any issues. Okay, we'll be playing for a few seconds and show you up the gameplay that is perfectly able to run on the com on Windows. So in that case, I hope this video likes you. Keep in mind if you have any concerns, any questions regarding the question process, do not hesitate to let it ask me on the commentary section. Keep in mind that all the information and all the files I've been using, it will be on the commentary in one. So thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.